Hey guys, Silicat2 here. Welcome back for more Golden Sun. Um, man, Isaac and Garrett are totally busted. They didn't even bring Jenna back with them, and now they're gonna wind up blowing up the whole village in an eruption. This is bad. What happened? Weren't Jenna and Craven with you? Uh. No! What do you mean they were taken away? This is all very complicated. I need you to tell us exactly what happened on the mountain. Don't do the same for both of you. Alright, now we get to watch a Super Mario RPG style to storytelling sequence. In grayscale. I like to know exactly what they're saying. <laughs> We had no idea the true sanctum. And Jen and Creighton, they're prisoners? Pretty much. They've been taken against their will. How awful. Do you think they can be saved? Yeah. Jen's brother Felix will protect them, won't he? That is a great healer. You have been very quiet. It's like you're a thousand miles away. A hovering stone, the one that appeared before Isaac. What about it? I've seen it before, in my dreams. In my mind's eye, it appeared here again just now and spoke to me. You saw it just now? It must be the wise one, guardian of the elemental stars. You told me what happened to you in Soul Sanctum. So what was the wise what does the wise one say about the eruption? Will the volcano destroy Veil? Vale? <coughs> it is impossible to stop the eruption now. Will Veil vale be Veil vale be safe. The wise one will prevent the lava from reaching us. What's the matter, Great Healer? The village will be destroyed, won't it? Something even more dreadful than Vale's destruction looms ahead. What could be worse than the destruction of Vale? A terrible power. Alchemy, isn't it? Elemental star gems house incredible power. And Vale's been guarding those gems? The Elemental Lighthouses will loose that power upon the world. Once the power of the gems has been released, the whole world will... The wise one wants us to get the gems back, doesn't he? What do you mean, no? This world is ours, the savior to destroy. Our inaction may bring about its destruction. What a pity. We cannot hope for salvation. We must save ourselves. Then what can we do? Requiring the elemental stars is their fate alone. Are you suggesting we place the fate of the world in the hands of Isaac and Garrett? Garrett is only a child. You can't expect him to bear such a burden. The wise one has spoken. Each of you shares responsibility for this. Now, each of you must make your own decision. I don't know what to do. Isaac, you decide. Isaac, will you accept the responsibility for the fate of the land? No. No. Way. I can't blame you. I would- I couldn't do it if I were in your shoes. It's a 
terrible burden to be responsible for the fate of the world. I fear that the great healer really wants you to say yes. Is it right to refuse when the world is in such jeopardy? Only would never doubt your courage just because you declined. Once you step outside the village, you cannot take back your decision. Think about that before we leave the sanctum, Isaac. I'm out of here. And so, the world began drifting towards fated destruction. I guess I don't really have a choice, do I? If I say no, I get the bad ending. Alright, I'll say yes. <laughs> you accept- oh, Isaac, you can't mean it! If you chose to leave your decision to Isaac, there shall be no further discussion. Oh, wise one, these two have accepted your request. Give us your next command. Whoa, there he is. You two are quite brave to take on this quest. I shall be watching you. Choose your destiny wisely, young ones. There he goes. The big man is the rock. That was the wise one. What does the wise one say? Felix must unlock the power. Find the lighthouses. We'll have the guidance of the elemental star. <coughs> um, then what? What should I do there? Surely that cannot be all the advice you can offer them, great healer. Seek the elementals, the djinn. They'll prove useful. Isn't there anything else? That is all. That's it? Isn't there anything else you can tell them? That is all, Mayor. I leave it up to you, Isaac. Garrett. Awkward. Hey, isn't it almost time to meditate? Oh, yeah, meditation, let's go. Yeah, sure, those guys just run away on us. Well, what good are those guys? Sending children off with no help or direction? I agree, but... They didn't give us any other choice. Then... When should they go? Doesn't sound like we can afford to wait. Tomorrow then? Tomorrow? Yes. Mom. Hey. Well, at least they had one nice dinner before they had to go out on their quest. Why is everyone hanging around the town gate? What? Didn't you hear? Isaac and Garrett are leaving Vale on a journey. I wish I could go. I heard it's going to be really dangerous. Like okay, that? So everyone's down there to say goodbye? Doggy! What a cute doggy. What, hey, what's the matter? Here, Isaac's mother isn't there to see you all. You're right, she's not there. <laughs> hey, should we go say goodbye too? Sure, let's go. We're counting on you, Isaac. Oh, and you too, Garrett. <laughs> yeah, nobody can trust Garrett. Don't drink the water if it smells funny, and take this with you too. Isaac got a nerve. 
I know not to drink stagnant water, sis. Don't listen to him, Isaac. He's a pig. He'll eat anything that's not tied down. <laughs> hmm, door is very late. Oh, that's right. <coughs> Auntie Dora asked me to give this to you, Isaac. The catch beads. Guess we're all set to go, huh, Isaac? Think again, Garrett. Must be very difficult for Dora. As Garrett's mother, I know how Dora must be feeling. But I still have Garrett's father while Dora has only Isaac. She doesn't want you to go, Isaac, but she knows you have to when it hurts to see you leave. They can't keep standing around here like this or I'll never leave. So, one final farewell. Farewell! Let's go. Wait, I changed my mind. I want to go back to Vale. Uh... Alright, my... Okay, first of all, let's equip these catch beads. Bestows the synergy catch when equipped. I'm going to equip that on Isaac. Catch lets you, um... Huh, there's not much around here that I can use catch on. Let's go say a goodbye to Mom. Before we go. So, what's this? It's closed. This be a warehouse or something. A storage shed, rather. <laughs> yeah, really. Who are you? You can't be... You're not Isaac, are you? Yes, it's me, Isaac. Let me in, Mom. Isaac, that's a lie. He promised not to return until he fulfills his mission. My Isaac would keep his promise. Go away. Um. How much money do we have? 70 coins. That... Isn't very much, but at least we can buy something before we go. Yeah, let's go back down to the shop. <clears throat> if I uh, took Jenna's stuff and sold it, I'd have a little bit more money to go buy. But, nah, I got nothing right now. So let's just go. Oh! <clears throat> There's the inn, since... Isaac's mom won't let him sleep at home. Ask me anything about armor. Let's buy the leather cap. They'll boost both their defenses by three points. Or four points, actually. That'll be good to have. Alright, now let's go outside and see over there on our map. Wandering around. He's probably going to be our first boss, so we better save. Alright. Uh, I don't know if we have time to fight our first boss. So I guess I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya!